Jeffrey Kane here with another question in the topic 3.2. We're dealing with a container which holds 20 grams of neon with mass number 20 and 8 grams of helium with mass number 4. And we want to know the ratio of the number of atoms of neon to the number of atoms of helium. Right, if we want to know the number of atoms of neon, all we have to do is divide the total mass of the sample of neon by the mass of one atom of neon, which is 20. Now we do have a unit mismatch, and we're going to see in a minute why that doesn't matter. But let's pretend for a minute that it does. If we want to convert 20 atomic mass units into grams, we just need to multiply by 1.67 times 10 to the times 10 to the negative 23 grams per AM mass. So that gives us 20 grams in the sample divided by 20 AMU times 1.67 times 10 to the negative 23 grams per AMU. U cancels with per AMU gram cancels with gram, and what we get is 1 divided by 1.67 times 10 to the negative 23rd atoms. And I, I'm leaving that 1.67 in there intentionally. We, we could do the calculation, but I'm going to leave it there for now. Next we need the number of atoms in helium, and it's the same calculation. We have 8 grams divided by 4 amu for the atom times 1.67 times 10 to the negative 23rd grams per AMU. And gram, again, AMU cancels with AMU, gram cancels with gram. And we get 2 divided by 1.67 times 10 to the negative 23rd. So finally, to answer the question, what is the number, what is the ratio of the number of atoms of neon to the number of atoms of helium? That's 1 divided by 1.67 times 10 to the negative 23rd, divided by 2, divided by 1.67, times 10 to the negative 23rd. And that constant cancels, and we get 1 half, or 0 0.5. So the answer would be B. Now, that was a complicated question for one mark, so let's take a step back and look, is there an easier way to do this? Because it turns out that Converting between AMU and grams made no difference. So instead, if I wanted to find the number of neon atoms, the ratio of the number of neon atoms to the number of helium atoms, I could just take the mass of the sample of neon, 20, and divide it directly by the mass of the atom, 20. And I can take the mass of the sample of helium, 8, divided by the mass of the atom. And I do have a unit mismatch. I wind up with grams per AMU and grams per AMU. But because the result is unitless, and because that weird gram per AMU unit cancels out, I wind up with I wind up with one divided by two. The same answer. I wrote an eight in there by mistake, but the, the mass of the helium atom is four, not eight. So two ways to solve the question. One, the long way, and two, the short way. You can do the short way if you're quite good with your, uh, you know, with your chemistry and your conversion between masses of samples and number of atoms in the sample.